will discuss down syndrome screening tests now uh, first of all we need to know that what is meant by screening testing basically the screening test is done to detect potential health disorder or a specific disease in people who do not have any symptom or sign of that disease basically the goal of the screening test is early detection early detection and lifestyle changes or surveillance to reduce the risk of disease or to detect it early enough to treat it most effectively so that is the basic goal of screening testing now as far as the down syndrome is concerned we have certain first trimester screening we have certain screening which are done in the second trimester as well so first trimester screening in case of the down syndrome is done at about 8 to 14 weeks of gestation and we have different test uh the most important among all is that of the combined test combined testing basically include three main uh parameters okay those are beta hcg papa a papa a means pregnancy associated plasma protein a and nt nickel transcarbonic there's a specific mnemonic for this and that is beta papa and nt Okay, so beta is for beta CG, papa is for pregnancy associated plasma protein A, and NT is for nuclear transcarbonic. So basically, the beta CG normally is two point two multiple of median, and it is increased in case of Down syndrome. So we need to know about the normal value first of all. Papa A normally is point five multiple of median. and it is decreased in case of the uh down syndrome so papa a is decreased beta is uh beta hcg is increased in down syndrome is because the strength of papa is decreasing with age and strength of beta is in increasing with age so this is how you will remember it now the second trimester screening done at 15 to 20 weeks of gestation and those include double test triple test quadruplet test double testing include maternal serum alpha fetoprotein uh, and free hcg total or free hcg okay triple test include three parameter if we uh, add up estriol along with the double test that is the triple test means maternal serum alpha fetoprotein hcg and estriol Now along with the uh, test done in the triple testing if we add inhibin we get the quadruplet test and that include maternal serum alpha fetoprotein hcg plus estriol plus inhibin so that becomes the quadruplet test now in order to uh, memorize these uh, test we have specific mnemonics okay so for combined test beta beti papa okay or you can say beta anti papa okay so beta beta cg anti anti nuclear translucency and papa pregnancy associated plasma protein a for triple test we have the mnemonic of bum b u m okay so b is for beta cg U for unconjugated estriol and M is for maternal serum alpha fetoprotein. In quadruplet test, we use the mnemonic of BUMI, which is uh, basically the test done in triple test along with inhibin. So BUMI include beta hCG unconjugated estriol plus maternal serum alpha fetoprotein plus inhibin. Now we have specific table for screening test of Down syndrome. The quadruplet test is done between 15 to 20 weeks of gestation. it has got detection rate of 81% and false positive rate of 5%. The combined testings are done between 11 and 13.6 weeks of gestation detection rate more than 90%, screen positive rate less than 2% and false 5% false positive rate. Integrated test done between 11 to 13.6 and 15 to 20 weeks of gestation detection rate is 95% and the false positive rate is 5%. So this is how the different uh, Uh, tests are done the different screening tests are done in the down syndrome okay for uh, the detail 
invasive tests like chorionic venous, sem venous sampling and amniocentesis. I will come back with another video. Thank you so much for your kind listening. Allah.